Unless you're my Aunt Chalzetta, do not call me. Hey guys, it's Wahima. But just call me Wah. Melanated. I don't understand why people choose to call instead of texting. This is not 1996. I really love texting. In fact, it's my preferred method of communication. I love to receive letters in the mail. I love when people write me notes. Oh my God, in school, me and my friends had write back books. Do you remember write back books? And you had them and some of them were Lisa Frank. Oh my God, remember your cute ass Lisa Frank write back book? So I love reading and receiving texts. And whenever anyone calls me, I get scared. Like, I feel like, oh my God, it's an emergency. Like, why are you calling me? A phone call is very invasive. I feel like you're asking me to stop what I'm doing and only talk to you. And you know how hard that is in this modern era? Like, I need to be able to read or watch TV or type or do something while I'm having a conversation with you. Like, I can't just like have one, like, like, who are you? You just like feel like you just want to come into my world. You want me to stop what I'm doing, only pay attention to you. There are some exceptions. Unless it's a friend who's out of state or someone I haven't talked to in a long time. If we're just starting to date and those sort of late night conversations that last a long time happen, I'm actually okay with that. But usually they happen late at night. I need to be able to multitask. I mean, there was a time where I could sit at the phone for hours, you know, when it had a cord and it was hooked up to the wall. But like now that like it doesn't have a cord and like I can text and do all kinds of magic on it, like I'm not trying to only have a phone conversation. Oh my God, and when I receive calls, if your number isn't stored, I am so confused. Like, I feel like someone is like coming into my bed. It's just so invasive, you know what I'm saying? It's just, it's just so invasive. I feel invaded upon. I know there's some people who are just really, really bad at texting and I don't know how we can be friends. I'm told what happens is you guys pick up the phone and it's like, oh, some this person left me a text. Okay, great. Oh, that happened, I'll respond later. You put it down and walk away, but then you don't respond later and then that makes me feel like you don't care about me. How can you? Get your phone, see that you have a message, read the message, and then not answer it. It's so backwards to me. You know what I do when I don't have time to answer a text? I don't read it. I wait until I'm at a place where I can read and respond at the same time. I love emojis. I just wanna send you emojis. Why won't you let me send you emojis? Whenever I watch old movies where I see people answering the phone, I'm like, oh my God, you have no caller ID. It's like a surprise when you answer the phone. But like now we have caller ID, so we always know who's calling us unless they're calling us from a block number or a new number because you know people will be changing their phone numbers all the time I am not one of those people I have had my cell phone number for 12 years who's calling me from Phoenix who is this person and then they don't leave a message the worst like do not call me from a number I don't know and then not leave a voicemail and then talking about I called you um I'm sorry some stranger called me, some stranger invaded me. It's that surprise, like gives me anxiety, like who wants all that? Okay guys, that's it for this video. Let me know what kind of phone person you are. Are you the kind to call people? Are you the kind to text people? Are you the kind that doesn't like to do either of those? This video was inspired by my friend Stacy Ose Kufer. I have linked her video up above, so go on ahead and check it out. She's really funny. She has a series with her friend Corey where it's called like Sip and Chat or Drink and Talk. Oh, and another thing is those people who don't have social media. For whatever reason, I don't trust people who don't have social media. All right, guys, have a fantastic day. Bye.